something that I grew up doing too was just kind of growing up in Bavard. We would just kind of, me and a bunch of my buddies would pick ramps this time of year. And we would kind of go back to the house and just kind of grill up some burgers and you know, have a good time with it. But uh, they're rare because it's just literally just a month, a peak season where you can really pick them. Um, so it was always a fun thing to look forward to each year. Get your hands dirty a little bit. Kind of scrape your knife down. You can kind of see where the root system starts. You want a really nice sharp knife is key too. The bulbs make really good for pickling. The leaves make really good for like pesto, ramp puree. Make like a compound butter. Um, yeah, they're great to eat, eat, eat pretty much everything. <laughs> Try not to pick too many in a certain patch, but as you can see, this is a mountain, mountain of ramps. And <laughs> I like getting the kind of like uh, medium sized leaves too. Better quality flavor, in my opinion. in here sometimes I see mushrooms but we'll see man. yeah we're gonna do a couple different preservative methods you know we like to pickle the bulbs um, you know we also like to we're gonna take these leaves and dehydrate them and we'll kind of make like a ramp powder um, that can go on different things, like you could do ramp seared scallops, for example, or any kind of protein. You want to put them on, um, they kind of tend to work better with uh, kind of lighter proteins. Uh, fish and seafood, chicken. Well, they're great on a burger too, you know. <laughs> 